We'll have this meeting with Tessa and then we're playing with Leslie. And then after that, we'll probably do either Red Dead or Warzone or I might just dip. Hello? Did you break off, brother? No, I uh, woke up from the hospital. I fell off the gotcha. mountain. Okay. Um, you want to? I can. I can come pick up if you want to. Nah, nah. Don't worry. I'm gonna meet with Tessa and then I'm gonna dip out. You don't want to come smoke these cunts, bro? I can't. I I went down, brother. Oh, like that? I thought yeah, it was yeah, just yeah. a helicopter. No, no, oh. no. No. You fucking egg, bro. It, I'm, bro. I'm so fat. It's it, it's starting to get annoying. Yeah, yeah. All right. Can you please just fucking lose some weight, man? Yeah, yeah. I got you. I need you, bro. I'm, I'm I got fucking you. struggling. Bro. I know, God I know, damn, but uh, I know. All right. That was so unlucky you, timing, bro. At the fucking air one. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. All right, bro. I love you too, man. Good shit, bro. Keep up the good work, love man. You, People, yeah, uh, it's best. not going unnoticed. Trust I me. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. You be safe. All right. All right, bro. Yeah. yeah, I'll catch you. No worries. Ramadan is soon. For real. What's up, Minty? How you been? All right, says I love you, bro, and then he that goes off. All right. My food's not even hot anymore, bro. It's just gonna be sitting there. It's gonna be so annoying. It's gonna taste so bad. It's like, let me go get my food really quick. Hey, Tessa. Hello. Hey, what's going on, Tessa? How you been? Oh, I've been good. I'm just uh, doing my thing, you know? Yeah, just checking in on what you see and how you're doing. Everything good with you? Oh, um, yeah, everything is uh, going pretty good. I've got a couple things going on on the docket right now, but um, I'm, I'm having to push charges on Croc for shooting a cat. He's a psychopath. Well, he got fired, but... so you don't have to, he's not a cop anymore. Uh, he got rehired. From who? Uh, DPD took him in. Huh? Yeah, so, uh, one of the first things he did when getting back was shoot a cat, so... We're working on that, but aside from that, Ranger stuff has been sort of picking up a little bit. There's more hunting calls that's been coming in, and... Uh, oh, oh, new thing. Um... We now get 1045 Alpha and 1045 Bravo. Bravo means that somebody is like taking the organs off of a, a human. And there's like a, a human corpse on the ground. <laughs> oh. Just so you know, that's uh, it's a new thing on our dispatch. So you might see like oh. a hunting call in the city. Oh, that's good but to it's, hear. It's actually someone just taking uh. someone's kidney. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. Yeah. I, I figured you should know. But 
Um, let's see. I've been getting Flop up to speed on everything. He's doing great, by the way. Um, yeah. David's actually approached me and, and was asking about a promotion. I told him to kind of no. keep his. Okay. <laughs> That's kind of what I thought. I just demoted but, uh... him. Who the fuck is he to start asking for a fucking promotion? Well, who, who, what's the boss on this guy? He approached me very respectfully about it. And he said that he didn't want us to think he was, you know, being disrespectful in, in putting his name in the hat. Because he, uh, he... he knows. But why are they asking for a promotion? Well, if you if somebody if you know. got demoted four days ago, why the fuck would you go up and ask for a promotion? That's a good question. Um, but I told him to temper his expectations because promotions in this department are a bit uh sparse. It's not sparse. It's do a good job and you get promoted. Oh well, yeah, that's what I meant. Like um. I don't know. It's hard to explain. Listen, I'm gonna just let I'm gonna just let something clear here, all right? Just because I'm not in du on duty, it doesn't mean I'm not tapped into what's going on. You know what I mean? I keep an eye on everything and every what everybody's doing. You know what I mean? There's been a lot of stupid shit that's going on. Yeah, I demoted fucking Mineo out of command, and now he goes and shoots Francis apparently without saying anything. I ha it's Soze's tell me about it. You know what I, I mean? Like I, I'm not. I have not even heard anything about that. It's just there's, there's a, all these officers doing shit. Even uh, I, honestly, I, I, listen, I'm not. Nobody's getting promoted if you just go on fucking duty every day. If, if you go on duty yeah. and do a mid job, just because I'm not gonna promote you just because you're doing a mid job. And, and and David's got demoted with uh, Maneo and Den Shiesty not even a week ago. So yeah. why is he coming up and starting to ask for a promotion? He's lucky I didn't. Well, he's lucky I didn't remove their uh, their certifications. But I told High Command I did. They don't under okay. They need to understand that the 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 shift in what the PD is trying to do is High Command is trying to do right now is there nobody's fucking around. Like you're on the ch everybody's on the chopping block. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right. Oh, that was a month ago? Oh, whatever, I don't give a fuck. I uh, Dulio was also asking about it as well, and I'm sure your answer What's is Dulio the same asking for? Uh, he wants sergeant. He's been gunning for sergeant for a while. Okay, and does he know what it takes to be a sergeant? I think you probably have to ask him that. Is he around? Uh, not sure. I don't know. What would you like me to tell him on that? I think he'd benefit from you saying, like, explaining to him. Yeah, I will. What about, um, um, Luis? Did, has Ziggy promoted her yet? I told him to promote her. Uh, I don't know, but if Ziggy doesn't get around to it, I can. Yeah, can you do it for me? Like. I just, I don't see her. You know? Yeah, what are we promoting her to? Just one level higher. Uh, corporal. Okay. Sounds good to me. She helped out a lot. What about, uh, what about Big Kearney. Murph? I don't see him very often. Uh, and that's not to say that he's not on duty or anything. I'm just saying I don't personally see him. We don't match up our schedules. I haven't heard anything about him, so I'm assuming he's behaving. All right. Is there anything? Is there anything you've heard about anybody or no? Um, no, actually, just uh, the situation somewhat recently with David's and Minio. But other than that, I'm, I'm gonna be uh, honest, Tessa. I'm, I, if they see what other departments are getting and they're, they want that replicated of them just being consistently on duty every day and getting promoted, I'm, that's not what I'm fucking doing. That's not what we were about. We were never yeah. about that. If they want to go on duty every day and then think that they deserve a promotion, that's not how it works. You do good PD work and you make yourself stand out better than others, that's what gets you the invitation into the Rangers. If you want me to be respectful and honestly, they've gotten invited into the Rangers and they've, they haven't 
done anything. They've, they, I can't, I don't, sep I can't separate them from everybody else. Uh, they're supposed to be separated from everybody else. They're supposed to be better than everybody else. I, if you want me to be honest, I don't. None of these, none of these uh, rangers, I can see them being separated from everybody else. I'm not talking about ranger work in the mountains. I'm talking about being a normal police officer. Yeah. So if they want to come on duty and think that they can get promoted, then go to switch to another department and see if that works out. But until these these rangers start doing better jobs, and I'm not saying of them being a good cop or a bad cop because these cops are good. These rangers are good. I wouldn't have made them a ranger if they were a bad one. But when, until yeah. they start separating themselves from everybody else, I don't see Julio separating himself from everybody else. I don't see uh, David's. David's does, but David's unfortunately had this fuck up with Mineo. So he has to lay low for a mm -hmm. week for a couple of weeks, and then he'll and then it'll get washed away, and then that if he he can't do this four days after he got demoted or came off suspension. Yeah, he has to do that, this. That's kind of two, what he has to do three. I told him as well. He should have done this three weeks after this happened, or or a month after. You know what I mean? Yeah. You, you don't do it four days. If he said this a month a month or a month later or three weeks later, then I'd say okay, yeah, you're right. And not when it's too the the, okay. the wound is still too fresh. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think maybe I portrayed it a little bit wrong. I think if you had been approached by him and you heard what he's had to say, you yeah, might of not course. Think I mean, I'm just going off like what you told me. You know what I mean? A butthole. I'm I'm just going off what you told yeah. me. Yeah. Yeah. No, he's uh he's very respectful and he completely took his uh, punishment in stride and I don't think he I don't intended I don't to I don't hate them. I fucking love everybody. Like I'm just saying, I personally, like, if Dulia really wants to get promoted, I haven't seen, and just because I'm not on duty doesn't mean I don't see. I haven't seen, I check in, trust me, I'm tapped in. I haven't seen any okay. of these people uh, separate themselves. I really haven't. I gen That's coming right. from me. If Ziggy feels otherwise, then talk to Ziggy, but personally for me, I don't, I haven't, um, I haven't seen them separate themselves. If, if you disagree, let me know. I gen genuinely, I don't mean to be a, like blunt about it. I'm, I'm I you know I think I, mean? I see where you're coming from. I don't, uh, I, I see a lot of David's taking control of scenes and he, he does a lot of leadership in, in a shift, yeah. uh, which is something that I would look for. Uh, Dulio is one of those people, he can take the lead, but he doesn't. Um, and he'll, uh, yeah. He's more of like a technical officer, and That's he, fine. he does things more in the background. I'll, I'll tell you right now, I just got out of a meeting with Soze, Bass, and everybody else in high command that run the departments, mm -hmm. and we were literally, the topic of the conversation was, we have too many high command and command members, 57 total, and they're trying to cut okay. it down. For me to promote Dulio and make him a command member after I just removed the Mineo, and I bring the Dulio in, the thing is, Mineo does a lot of dumb shit, but Mineo was a very good field officer. Yeah, he didn't do his MDW shit, and that's why he got demoted, and he did a lot of stupid shit. That's what got him demoted. I didn't know about this MDW shit, okay. but I'm saying Dulio, Dulio has that thing. He needs to work on the other thing. For you to be a command member, I'm not gonna. Yeah. If you don't bo check off all the boxes, you're not gonna be. In, you're not gonna be a, a lieutenant or whatever, or a or a or a, or a, okay. or a sergeant. You 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 check you check off the boxes. Yeah, you're not that vocal on the scene. But you help me run this department, and you do everything else. You know, understand what I'm saying? And you were there from the start. Yeah. Z Ziggy, Ziggy, mean Ziggy. You know what I mean? Barry, I haven't seen Barry. Even Jerry, like Jerry, doesn't do anything. I haven't seen this motherfucker on duty in a, in a while. That stinker. He gets. <laughs> he'll go on duty, respond to one call, and then go back off duty like a potato. Yeah. He clocks on for his one. I don't, shift and then he leaves. I don't need to be physically in this city for me to tell everybody what to do. Me, you, everybody pe being invited into this department should already know what to do without me having to tell them. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. No, I get that. I respect it too. So when if people say they want to be promoted, that shit irks me. You'll get promoted yeah. once you do a good job. I and you got to come about it per correctly. I talked to Luis. Luis didn't even ask me for promotion. She just talked to me and she kept checking in on me. And I realized, I was like, wait, hold on. Let me, uh, and then like, I got tapped into what she was doing. And then I told her, I said, I got something to tell you for uh, at the end of the week. But I don't know if Ziggy promoted her or not. I want to talk to her as soon as possible. Put that at the top of your list. Okay. Promote, because I, I don't see her. All right. I will absolutely do that. Thank you. I'll make a, a thing of it. Am I wrong? Uh, 
no, I don't, I don't necessarily disagree with you. I think um, our promotions are, I, I use the word sparse, but I, I think maybe sparing would be a better yeah. word. Or thought out. we're very particular. Because we, we don't want to just promote everyone and then have, like you said, everyone in high command or command. Because we don't need it necessarily. And I think we have a department that's respected. And you don't need rank to do pretty much anything. Yeah, literally. Um, like, I, I don't even need the rank that I have to get the things done that I need to do. Uh, yes, I get sidestepped sometimes if, if someone outranks me and wants to do something, but that doesn't stop me from pushing stuff on the docket or doing my job in any real capacity. So if, if people respect me and I'm respectful to them, then that's all I really need. I don't need to force someone to do my bidding when I'm, you know, a high rank or whatever. Yeah. And I, a lot of the shift is just too many cooks. We have, we already have too many people in command positions. And I do agree that there's a lot because we, no. yesterday we had a shootout going on and there were people trying to take over um, and they did it respectfully, but it still was like, who's in command here? You know, and that, that kind of thing happens often. Hmm? So... I don't disagree with you. I think uh, being picky in particular about it is the smart way to go about it rather than just taking in anybody and, and promoting everyone just because they've been around for a long time. Yeah. And uh, I'm glad you agree with me. I hope you agree with me. Like, I don't know if you're just telling me what you want me to hear, but I really hope you agree no. with me. I like think I said, I, I, I'm not going to... I, I'm really, really not gonna try to. I'm not blending in. I'm not that. I've never been like that. I'm not gonna blend in with everybody else. I'm gonna set myself apart from others. That's what this department. We're gonna set ourselves. To, and we just so they said. Nothing, there's SDSO and the Rangers are the only two departments that are actually doing it properly. He said. Yeah, I mean, I'd I'd love to be able to promote everyone that wants a promotion, but realistically thinking about it, I just don't think it's feasible. And it's not. It, like you said, if they're not checking all the boxes then we need to think about that and we need to no. address that with them as well because otherwise we're there's just a high standard here flounder. in the rangers you know if you you, you if you want to go to a non-high standard department go to it then leave there's a high standard here yeah it's this that's what i said coming into this so nothing's okay. changed you fuck up you get got okay. you, you get kicked out you know, Mineo, next step, if they fuck up again, they're done. I, I'm removing them. I don't, I'm not, I'm not even going to demote them. I'm just going to kick them out. Mineo, Davids, right. anybody. So, you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, that's pretty much and it. That's what the troopers are doing too. So I think we should definitely keep that That's standard. what all our PD is doing. But yeah. All right. Well, that's I mean, you good have, to know. have him come talk to me. I'll talk to him. Yeah, I think I really think Dulio would benefit from having a conversation with you, so he can kind of tell you where he's at, and uh, you can explain where you're at as well. Cause Cause uh, I, if you want me to be honest wanna... with you, this keeps fucking happening with Dulio as well. Every six fucking months, I get word that he's upset that he hasn't gotten promoted. It happened last time at the fucking meeting with everybody, uh, and he was upset that somebody else got, uh, that, that, uh, Big Merv got promoted and he didn't. And then we gave him the promotion. And then here we go, six months go by and the same things happen again. It happened as well before with Senior. It just keeps happening. Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna give out petty promotions just because you want one. I don't give a fuck anymore. You know what I mean? Yeah. You, know, okay. you check the fucking boxes off and you get fucking promoted. It's not hard. It's not a hard concept. And I'm not hard on anybody. That's that it goes for everybody. It's not just Dulio. It goes hard on Mina. It goes for it goes for it goes for Big Merv. It goes for everybody. Maneo. It goes for yeah. Davids. It goes for everybody. I mean, it, but if Ziggy wants to promote him, talk to Ziggy. 
But mommy says no go as daddy. That's that's what's gonna happen. Dude, we'll, we'll see what happens. Well, I don't think Ziggy's out to do that to you. I know, I'm just saying. Like that's what's gonna happen. But then let, let them go as Julio. Let them go as Ziggy. In my opinion, I personally I wouldn't promote anybody right now. Nobody's nobody's checking off all the boxes. Okay. Alright. So that's just me. I'm good with that. I'm really laying down the law. I'm not I'm not fucking around anymore. I, I, I like I, I let a lot of shit slide, but I'm not letting it slide anymore. I want everybody to be here uh on top. Okay. Well, I appreciate personally that the standards are getting raised a little bit because for a while there it was a little yeah. a little sketchy. Um but we'll see how it goes. All right, sounds good, Tessa. Is there anything else you need from me? You've been good, though, you? Yeah. Well, I went to jail. How'd that go? I appealed the charge, and they destroyed Bill Mays in court. Oh, hell yeah. My record is clean. Fuck yeah. All right, well, you know where to find me. Uh, we have that email chain with Ziggy and I, and you, so... Uh, yeah. Let's, let's keep communication in there constant. Okay. Um, but yeah. All right. All right. Oh, the uh, fishing <sighs> tournament went really well. Yeah, how'd that way. go, by the way? Okay. I'm sorry I couldn't make that. I wasn't even around. I was in Florida. That's okay. It's uh, It went really good. We got funding from the mayor's office. Nice. And uh, he did promise that if we need any more next time, we'll probably get uh, the same amount. We have a million dollars. So if uh, we're wanting to do it again, which I definitely <clears throat> am, we had a huge turnout. Okay. But, yeah. Good stuff. Glad to have everybody have fun. That's all that matters. I think so, yeah. Nice. Hopefully. Hell yeah. Uh, everything else, what, uh, any, if there's anything you need. One person got kidnapped, but. Nah, fuck it, whatever. That's what's going to happen. It's Los Santos. All right. What about you? You like, you're, is there anything you want to talk to me about personally? You good on everything? Um, for me, I, honestly, you know me. I don't really need anything. I'm good. All right. If I do, I'll let you <clears throat> know. Yeah, talk to me. All right, yeah. Tessa, you have a good day, right? I'm going to head out of here. You too. Good All to right. see you. Yep, you as well. Like I said, keep that email chain alive. Okay, I will. All right. I like the remix to the Robin Hood, but now it's my turn. Na -na 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 -na. Yeah, anyways, amazing. She's the man. Masterpiece. Cheetah Girls? Cheetah She's Girls. She's the man. If you want to be my love. Wait, sorry. I'm so sorry. That's Spice Girls. Cheetah Girls. What no. is this? I Love Music Volume 3? <laughs> Excuse me? Do you remember that? I Love Music? That's what I call Music 3. No, it's not I It's not. I Love Music. It's Now that's what I call music. Yes. That's what and I was. I bought those. You did? Yes. You called the 1-800 number? No. Wait, what do you mean? I didn't. Call the one. You just go to Target and buy it. I thought there was like a one eight hundred number yet to uh to buy the. Now that's what I call music. You have to you call a a a, a phone number. I'm pretty sure it was like one eight hundred. The commercials they call one eight hundred to get a. No, you just go to the store and buy it. Oh. They're at Target. Okay, but did you listen to the Cheetah Girls? Hell no. <laughs> I didn't listen to that shit. I listened to not shit.